in today's um, um, era around um, all the political controversy and health reform and all those kind of things, what is your perspective on all of that? We hear a lot of um, uh, gloom and doom in some areas, and um, we hear um, that we're moving in the right direction in others. Uh, what is your perspective uh, on, on the issues we face today? I think we just have to learn that there are ups and downs constantly. Uh, it, the, the way government works and functions and finances is always going to change. The responsibility of our field and you as a uh, also, uh, leading age, I, I'll get that yet, <laughs> that the strength of coming together, which was one of the reasons we started, was to say we have one voice to say to government agencies. This is what we need. This isn't what we want. Just uh, This is needed to care for people. And that we have a responsibility of uh, somehow caring for people who run out of money. And that's what we do. As I say, I, I'm proud of the fact there's never been a person asked to leave a campus for proven inability to pay. Yeah. yeah. And that, that's, that's what we're to keep emphasizing. Are you um, hopeful about the future uh, of, um, of, of our field in particular in the country in general, or um, uh, are you alarmed about it or despondent uh, about any of that? No, I, I assume it's going to grow. As long as we see ourselves working together and not separating, so working through a <coughs> leading age, that uh, I see a future, yes. It, as long as we keep reminding people why we do this and why the need is there, that we're not just creating a situation, we're responding to a need, and we've got to properly do that. And, and I, there will always be people, particularly in the faith-based places, uh, that will do this. The proprietary field will always exist because they make money, and that's why they're in the business, to make money. Uh, we're in a business based on our faith that we need to be doing this.